Tax refund troubles continue in Norfolk. Mo Money Taxes did not hand out those refund checks today as promised. Angry customers waited outside the Granby Street location for hours. Many say the IRS confirmed their refunds have been deposited into the tax preparer's account. Ten of your side broke this story originally. Mo Money employees told us there was a software glitch. The CEO says the glitch has been fixed, but still no checks. Ten of your side's Ann McNamara has new information now. And is this company being investigated? Nicole, this is the first day we've heard Norfolk Police Economic Crimes Unit is working with the Attorney General's office, and they're also working with the IRS to find out where these refund checks are. Now, the store has not opened yet today. You can see there is a line. There is a heavy police presence here. That is why people are getting into the line. But again, still, the door is locked. Mo Money Taxes CEO Marquis Granberry told 10 on your side 200 checks will be handed out at the Brambleton Avenue location Monday at noon. He said there would be armed security guards. When we got there, the business was boarded up and we found customers waiting in line. At noon, Granberry texted me the location switched to Granby Street. There we found locked doors and even more angry people. He took my social security numbers from me and my kids. He took my account number, my rounding number, he could do anything to me. He could, somebody in Memphis, Tennessee could be me right now. We're not talking about small checks here. I have a line of people here. They're all going to tell you how much money they're owed. Ma'am, how much money? $8,337. $2,000. My girlfriend found. $4,500. Sir, how much did you say you were owed? $2,374. How long are you going to wait here, sir? Until they open. And if they don't? It's my money, and I need it now. Some of those angry customers called police. And I'm curious as to why the police aren't involved with this as far as bringing this gentleman here to disperse our checks. It's not a police matter. Shortly after, police arrived to control the crowd. What did you say about the IRS? We do not work for them. That's all. No. Right, but you don't think this is a problem? This. Thank you. Customers who filed formal complaints with the IRS at the federal building downtown were told federal investigators are looking into what happened to the refund checks. Police say they alerted the IRS and the Attorney General's office about the problem. Call the IRS. You, you'll get more mileage out of there than standing out here thinking these folks are going to open the door and start passing out checks. But that's what they're still doing. Actually, a lot of people that are in this line have gone to the federal building downtown Norfolk. It's at 200 Granby Street. They filed a formal complaint with the IRS. The police say at this point, that's the best you can do for yourself if you're like them and you're still waiting on a check. Now, 10 on your side went one step further. We contacted Congressman Bobby Scott. My colleague Andy Fox will have that story coming up at 530. You won't want to miss it. For now, live on Granby Street, I'm Ann McNamara, 10 on your side. And you can find Ann's entire phone interview with Mo Money CEO on wavy.com tonight at 530. How one local congressman is responding to 10 on your side's investigation and why people would go to Mo Money for their taxes.